So Netflix just dropped the cast of the new Dark Crystal series they got going on, and uh, we're going to get to see some uh, images, right? Mm, yes, friend. <laughs> right now on Miscast Entertainment Reactions. Here's Tony. I love the smell of my cup in the morning. Head to the chopper! Stand up to my ear, friend! I'm going to make it an off again. This is Sparta! You're going to need a bigger boat. Welcome back, you miscast miscreants, to another reaction video, this time with our host, Greg. Hello, friend. And mm. this guy, William Davis Moore, and we're going to get right into it. So what do we got, Greg? All right, so like you said, Netflix today uh, dropped the cast list and a few images for the brand new upcoming series, The Dark Crystal Age of Resistance. Age of Resistance. Yeah. Did we know the title beforehand? Uh, I don't know if we knew the title quite yet, but uh, nothing. We didn't know who the cast was. We didn't. Everybody was kind of clamoring, wondering when was when this was going to come out. We still don't have an exact date. We know it's going to be sometime next year in 2019. It's going to be made by Jim Henson Company, who right made now. the original 1982 film. Obviously, course, right. This is going to be a prequel series. Yeah, because. They ended it in the end of the movie. So. Well, there was talk of there being also a sequel movie at some point, you oh, know. Right. So, um, but uh, no, this is a prequel series. The Dark Crystal breaks again. That's it. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Going to be executive produced and directed by Louis Leterrier, who did uh, Now You See Me, Clash of the Titans, Transporter. Oh, right. You know, so he's, he's got a he's got bumpy a bumpy track. Right? You know, <laughs> as a director, I can't say I'm his biggest fan. No, but. Uh, <laughs> He insisted that there be no CGI used in this series. It's all going to be puppets, which is going to be awesome. Okay, but I mean, e even in the old one, they used other special effects besides just practical. right. But it's not; they're not going to rely on CGI right. characters and whatnot. It's going to oh, be all oh, yeah, puppetry all right, cool, and everything. Cool, I'm so, down with that. So uh, it's going to be ten episodes, and Good. Uh, yeah. So Good. Um, the only returning character we know of is uh, Agra. The ogre, the ogress with the eye. Yeah, she's the only returning character that we know of, so she's still alive in this timeline. Apparently, it would be cool if this is like how the crystal got fractured in the first place. Yeah, I, I wonder really if we're like gonna that. go there or not. I, I, I apparently not because I think that happened like thousands and thousands of years before. Wasn't she there for that though? Uh, I don't. Remember. She's like the Yoda of this. Yeah, universe. pretty much, pretty much. <laughs> and she scared the ever living crap out of me She's when I creepy. was a little kid. You know, oh, yeah, man. <laughs> I remember hiding behind the couch when that little eye. She would have the yeah. eye in her hand. So she's gonna be voiced by um, Donna Kimball, who uh, apparently was, is from the Happy Time Murders, your favorite movie. Oh yeah, all you right. know. <laughs> Check out our uh, review for that one. The stars. Let's of get this to thing. it. So here we go. You got Taron Egerton. From uh, Kingsman and that abomination Robin, Robin Hood, Hood that just came out. <laughs> yep. Total abomination. The blue Robin Hood. <laughs> he's going to voice, uh, and uh, I think this is going to be right, uh, he's going to voice a character named Ryan. He uh, looks like the other Gelflings. <laughs> yeah, he does kind of look like the, uh, the, original, uh, the original Gelfling. Or maybe Rian. I don't know. He is described as a crystal castle guard from the fierce Stonewood clan. Okay. okay. So three of the main characters are from uh, three different clans out of seven Gelfling clans, apparently. Next up, you got Annie Taylor Joy from The Witch and Split. Okay. And A Glass that's coming out. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. right. Yeah, yeah. Yep, yep. Right on. She's cool. She's great. Uh, she's going to voice a character named Brea from the Noble Vapra clan. So she's very regal looking, you know, she's very, like she's a noble woman. The noble never ending Gelfling. story. Uh, queen, that's what she looks right? like. Right, yeah, the or, princess or whatever it is. She's like the Lord of the Rings come to Henson. Right. <laughs> Who live in the Gelfling capital city. So there's a Gelfling capital city? Was that's there, it. I don't, was, the Gelflings were like hunted to almost extinction in the movie, right? Like there were yeah, a whole they were, bunch of them. Right. right, there weren't a whole lot from what I remember. Um, I, just, I remember them sapping the essence from those other little creatures. Yes. Yeah, I forgot the names them, of those. You know? Sucking them dry. So, uh, <laughs> and then the third star of the uh, show is going to be uh, Natalie Emmanuel from uh, Game of Thrones and Furious 7. Oh, cool. And she is going to voice uh, a character named Deet of the cave-dwelling Grottens who never set foot above ground. So she can see that her eyes kind of like look like you know, haven't seen the sun very much. He's very pale. Then you have a whole host of other actors and actors, big name actors. So you have Helen the Bottom Carter. You do have Natalie Dormer. She's going to be in it. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> Eddie Izzard. 
You have uh, Toby Damn. Jones. You have Mark Strong voicing a character. You have Alicia Vikander from Tomb Raider uh, uh, voicing a character. You got Mark Hamill. No voicing, shit. Uh, voicing a uh, Skeksis. Skeksis or a Mystic? We're not sure yet. He's awesome um, though, with so, the evil voices. Oh, he's so, great with the voice. Yeah. So I could assume. I assume he's gonna be playing a Skeksis. That would be sound great. like the Joker and shit. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You got Ralph Innocent, who's also in Game of Thrones. You got Jason Isaacs from uh, uh, all kinds of different. Wow, things. man! Keegan Michael Key. That's a that's a going to be a weird one. I'm probably going to play a mystic, I would think. Simon Pegg, Andy Samberg. Dang. All, all, so you got a big and a bunch of others. So that's awesome. Those are the biggest names that I recognize. Dude, what's the budget on this thing? Like eight uh, that's bazillion a good question, dollars. You know, I mean, that's, that's a good a question. I mean, listen, it's Netflix, <laughs> and they just been. Seriously, money out <laughs> all over the place. So I don't know. So I was excited for this when it was first announced back in um, uh, May of 2017. Uh, they start production on it in November of 2017. Cool. And uh, yeah, now we're finally gonna get to see it. I think. And hopefully, hopefully we don't have to wait too much longer. Dude, I want to see it now, man. I, yeah, when, hell yeah. It was only like two months ago when they first like announced it, or at least I heard about it. And okay, yeah. Like I said, I heard. I've, seems I've, like forever. I've been trying to follow it for a while, and there hadn't really been a whole lot of news nah. coming out. All we got was like a little bit of a, a behind the scenes kind of making a video, you know, to yeah, to advertise nothing. it. But it was very yeah, yeah, not too much there. It was a teaser's teaser teaser. It's definitely not a kids movie though. Oh I mean. no! Like I said, it scared the crap out of <laughs> yeah. me when I was a little kid, man. But yeah, you know, man. I love the Skeksis now. Yeah, man. Um, you know, it's it's always fun to do that voice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. I was saying earlier how all the 80s uh, bad guys have that high-pitched voice. Right, like yeah. He-Man yeah. and Skeksis and what was it? Starscream yeah. and Transformers. Exactly. A lot of good you are, Beast Brain. Starscream. I'm just saying goodbye. Stay, M friend. Prophecy. Prophecy caused all this trouble. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Um. I hope it's from. I hope it's the beginning. I really. I always wanted to see like how the whole thing started. It's probably not going to be that far back. It's I'm, gotta, I'm excited. Yeah, about it's going to be cool. So uh, you know, put on my nerd glasses and geek out <laughs> over this thing you know, with the rest of you. You get the Dungeons and Dragons. It's right oh, up there in that same genre. Pick that up in our store. Yeah, man. All right, so that's going to do it for this reaction then. All right, let us know what you guys think. If you're excited about it, let us know in the comments and uh, you know, tell us your views on the Dark Crystal. All right, guys, as always, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, hit us up on MiscastEntertainment.com. Christmas isn't here yet. You can still get some sweet-ass merch. Boop. And uh, until the next time, peace. Mm -hmm. Friend. <laughs> <laughs>